Hey guys, so Tesla went to $250 yesterday, it makes me happy. Uh, at first not because I was trying to buy more and then the price has been chasing away from me uh, since $235 and that was my last buy. But um, yeah, I decided to stop buying. Um, I, I don't like to chase price and... and um, and and I have bought more than enough um, currently due to the investment I made I think I made an investment of about 50% of my portfolio cash then but I also uh, leveraged it up and uh, and due to that uh, I borrowed a margin loan uh, and so I have about two times more share um, than the cash that I have uh, invested and so uh, that means that um, yeah it goes up uh, quickly uh, the exposure uh, from 50% to now about 70% exposure in my portfolio so buying more is not justified anymore price is now 250 uh, that's of course considerably higher than 180 huh? or 200 when I got really excited about it um, uh, but but of course it has a lot to do with my exposure that's already now 70% in my portfolio huh? or, or let's call it 60% because I invest a little bit in the in the genomic um, revolution ETF also uh, but but that's of course a very big exposure and we're just getting started uh, like I do think $250 and even $300 are still great in the prices to invest in Tesla but it all depends on your exposure. If you have already invested a lot, no, then it's not, of course. Um, if you already have a big exposure, then it's not. But if you have a small exposure, it is, I think. It's also compared to your other investments. Huh? Um, so um, if the risk reward is, let's say, uh, very good, then um, much better than your other investments, then it deserves a bigger exposure, even at $250 or at $300. But so in my case, uh, I think, um, yeah, I should stop buying and um, uh, let it ride now. Um, uh, but because the, the, the value goes up, I do get um, new um, a margin excess in my brokerage account uh, that allows me to buy other Tesla, but also other investments. And um, I'm considering to buy more... Uh, Genomic Revolution ETF. I have about 10%, so from that 70%, uh, basically Tesla, um, it's about 10%, so about 7% is now um, um, uh, gen Genomic Revolution ETF. Uh, Arc G, it's called Arc G, uh, the symbol. Uh, so it's about 7% in my portfolio Arc G, and then about 60% uh, Tesla. I think I will I will buy more um, um, ArcG with 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 uh, margin excess that I have available, and, and so my liquidation price right now is about two hundred and ten dollars for Tesla. Um, if the price goes below that, uh, I will get uh, uh, liquidated. Uh, I mean, not all my shares, but it will start to shell, sell off some shares. Um, and uh, and if I buy more of anything then that price goes up so if I buy more for example um, uh, arc G then um, uh, this liquidation price goes up but that's what I'm planning to do I'm planning to raise this to from two hundred and ten dollars to two hundred and twenty dollars uh, and buy some more other assets arc G um, and that means that my risk goes up uh, um, I mean, there's a higher chance that Tesla corrects from 250 to 220 than to 210. But the, uh, and since Arc G is a, a, another great investment, uh, okay, it's not it's not it's not so underpriced as Tesla is, uh, I think, eh, because it has been going up for 100 percent this fund and and also the genomic um, industry uh, of uh, healthcare um, companies that are focused on this uh, have been going up I suspect also around this 
around 100% over the past five years. This is outperforming, outperforming the S&P 500, who just went up 50%. So, 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 so that, that that's a pity, of course. You, I prefer to buy things that have underperformed. Uh, the stock index has not overperformed it. But of course, a, a sector like this, a small sector like this, can can, can greatly outperform. Uh, the indexes, um, especially when it's a managed fund that uh, is composed of value picks with a good management, then this can greatly outperform S&P 500. Not only do double as much in five years, but do 10 times as much. So uh, why I think this is a great investment is because, well, it is managed by Catherine Wood, who has been uh, starting her own um, investment company five years ago and started several ETFs and has done great calls has a great track record and um, and is very admirable a fund manager so picking one of those funds uh, that is focused on something very different than um, uh, the Tesla uh, and, and that she believes may be ready for prime time and and, and, and find a lot of adoption a lot of uh, patients that start to pay money for these kind of um, uh, treatments uh, that um, uh, may really find solutions to diseases that are very important uh, like blindness or cancer or uh, very very big problems that um, we have uh, that may be solved by some of these companies yeah I think this this can be uh, this can go up a lot especially when we are in a secular uh, stock bull market it can even become an investment team huh? uh, so so I think this is a, a very interesting investment um, and, and 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 investing in that um, may uh, may 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 bear fruits um, and so using um, borrowing more money from my broker at four percent um, I think is a great plan even though uh, it does increase my risk to be liquidated, uh, but since it's a, a different kind of investment, I think it's worth uh, taking that risk. Thanks for watching. Bye.